What's going on everybody? Welcome to G Miles World and right here we're going to be playing some draft champions. This is a Tuesday night draft where you can get souped up teams. So obviously right now when you're looking at all these 99s and 98s, it's not something that's like, oh wow, how do you do that? Pretty much you play on Tuesdays and they give you those type of things. So either way, we're going up against Tom Brady and I also have 99 overall Tom Brady. But this guy right here, man, um, you know, I really, really don't understand exactly how you know these dudes just come out with these wild schemes bro and their full intent is to just throw the ball up and hold triangle but that's neither here nor there or what is it why on xbox whatever it is bro the aggressive catch is a savage move bro but um other than that if dudes don't want to do that the next best thing is drag routes or just trying to hit you in the flats now if you're new to madden over the last couple years, I, I don't really know how far I can go back, but I can't remember. Maybe one of you guys can help me out, because it's been so long. The last time that flats actually worked in the Madden game. I don't I don't know. I'm, I'm trying to think back, because I know even like in, um, yeah, pick me up. Yeah, yeah, pick me up regardless. Yeah, Will Fuller. Don't worry about it. Um, What, what was that year? Uh, it might have been 12, where the flats actually worked. I think it was 12. Um, you guys can let me know. I, I, I'm pretty sure that you guys know more than I do because you guys like study and know exactly what years uh, every Madden was doing whatever. Somebody's going to be able to tell me exactly what it was, but I've played every Madden. I, I know for a long time though, at least since like 15, 16, and 17, the flats have been an issue, um, as well as other zones. Um, they just don't play the area or they don't react, but that's, that's just something that's part of the game. Uh, obviously, there's different ways of shading where you can adjust the way that they do play coverage. But that's for like guys that are like the top level players and stuff like that. Yo, like right there, he played the flat, but I adjusted. Oh, well, why was that coach running out? Did you see that? Did you see my coach running out there like that? What the hell was that about? Is that a penalty? W whatever, it doesn't really matter. Uh, so look, you can actually shade, you know what I'm saying? To uh, Even if you have like a regular zone, if you wanna like make sure that they play down in a certain area or they play like a real quarter flat or whatever like that. Oh, punch him in the face. Is that Eric Reed that just got punched in the face? Yo, I'm telling you, if the next dude, bro, the next dude that get punched in the face, bro, you know what I'm saying? Oh, one more again, bro, one more again. Why is he just running like that with his head down? It doesn't matter. Oh, that lurk, listen, that lurk right there though, listen, I'm gonna tell you, look, that right there to me is the lurk of the year. You guys might have to pause the, pause the video go back and look at it but when that happened i was because like i just read the play because you know what it is when you're playing a guy and you know that his first intent is to throw you the ball you just make a read and you don't really care you know what i'm saying you just like you know what i'm gonna gamble sort of like how what was that dude's name um i forgot a little short dude that used to play for the patriots he was like a number one gambler i can't remember his name not not ah oh, frick man he was known as like a wild gambler bro and the dude would get beat sometimes but for the most part he would jump in and pick the ball what the F was his name? He was like maybe like 5'10", 5'11". Oh, this duel right here, though. Yo, guys, I've been really working on that. Um, I'm going to start to be able to send duel with just like four. Like, it's really, really real out here at g Myers World. But I can't remember his name. Uh, but he got traded. Uh, of course, all the Patriots get traded. But he was on the Patriots for a little bit. I cannot remember his name. It's just really, um, you know, slipping my mind. But he was known as like a gambler. He was part of one of their earlier Super Bowl teams. Not Ty Law and all them other boys. And Rodney Harrison and all the other... Samuels. It's a Samuel. Was it Samuel? Yeah, Sam, is it Asante Samuel? I think, I think that's his name. Let me know if that's his name. I'm trying to remember. But the dude was known as a gambler. Oh, get the F off me. F you, bro. And your moms, too. Um, what He would just gamble wildly and just come right down and just pick you up. Or he would get beat deep. It was very, very wild and ridiculous, but it was just, it was, it was what he was. You know what I'm saying? That's what he was. And um, as simple as that, you know, some players make those type of plays. Okay, yeah, Tom Brady's match strong. And it is what it is. But like I said, with that lurk, like I just knew, I just, I was just gambling like Asante Samuel, bro. Like I was just a gamble and he just threw it right to me. And it was, a, I can't say I was amazed because the dude was just running around doing whatever he wanted at any time. This guy's a savage beast, bro. And he did, you know, you got to give him a lot of credit because a lot of dudes would have already rage quit the game when you see where it's about to go right now because I think he's about to throw me a pick, right? Oh, no, no, it's not a pick. They swatted down automatically. That, that, that's just something that happens. The, I, I'm, oh, the duel. Bro, the duel though? Bro, was that duel? Okay, oh, duel again. Bro, was that the same play? What is this guy? Is this guy serious? Okay, and he's just gonna throw it right to me. All right, that's what I'm saying. See, at this point in the third quarter, you would think that with maximum duel action, and me picking the ball off every chance I get that the guy will probably rage quit. But he, he was built stronger than a lot of these dudes. You know what I'm saying? So the dude stayed through and it's only gonna get worse. You know what I'm saying? It's not gonna get better. So, you know, he had to make a decision and just say to himself, you know what? I gotta really sit here and lube myself up. Cause, oh my God, bro, pick me off. Oh, oh what am I talking about pick me off? I was about to, about to say, like, yeah, I gotta pick the ball. But the, it's just because of the way that he threw it though. 
because right there, um, well, that was a dot, but the way he threw it inside, that's the only reason I went for the pick. If it was a straight line streak and you go for a pick, it's automatically a moss. Okay, so guys, understand it. I got a game coming soon that's arguably the game of the year. I don't know if it can be arguably, bro. It's the game of the year, dog. Uh, it was against uh, Tote, We Tote 30s. He's another uh, Madden streamer on Twitch. Um, you guys probably know of him. I think he's in the top 100. I think he's definitely in the top 100, but I'm not sure what his number is. We Tote 30s. Dude is definitely an official player. We played a god, y'all. Oh my goodness. I don't want to get, I don't want to spill the beans, bro. But we, we, I can't call it a sweaty, I can't call it intense. You guys gonna have to come up with your own name for it. It was such a wild game. What the hell is it? What are these animations that are going on? I don't know. I'm not even paying attention to this game no more. Just pick me off to end the game, whatever. Yeah, come out. Come out right here and throw a dot. Throw a dot just to end it real quick. Throw this dot. All right, good job. Good job. My guy went for the pick and he just let him catch it anyway. Whatever, man. It is what it is. Like I said, I hope you guys are enjoying the content. Definitely subscribe. G Myers World. Follow me on Instagram, Twitter. Like me on Facebook at G Myers World. We're gonna be back shortly. I don't know how many more draft champion games I'm gonna play, to be honest. Maybe just head to head. See you guys and girls next time. One love.